just left the Philbrook and we're downtown now. Is that where we are? Are we downtown? Uh, we're actually in Brookside. Yeah. Okay, so we're actually in Brookside and we're gonna go grab lunch. My camera died, so right now I'm filming on my phone. This feels kind of weird, but we're gonna go eat and then probably head back to Leah's apartment and then see what else we can do today. Just sat down. It's a really cute restaurant. They have like this whole outdoor seating area and they already have some Christmas decorations up. This is one of those restaurants where you can use your phone to access the menu and I've noticed a lot of places have been doing that since, you know, this year. And I think that's really nice. I really like it. I don't really know what kind of food I'm in the mood for, so we'll see. I think Leah is in heaven. <laughs> As an appetizer, we ordered crispy Brussels. Mm. Very flavorful. It's like salty and crispy, but still has good flavor to it. I'm gonna try this sauce. It's an aioli sauce. It's actually really good. For lunch, I got a grilled chicken wrap with the truffle fries. Leah got uh, a French dip. Yeah, French yes, dip. Leah got a French dip. And she got the truffle fries as well, which is what so the waiter that. recommended that we get. The waiter was like really talking up the truffle fries, so give it a try. What do you think? The really hot. Really hot. I can't really very, do it. Very hot. I can't do it. <laughs> Let's try this chicken wrap. It looks so good. I don't know if you guys can like really see it, but <laughs> give it a try. So I'm definitely just fell out on my jeans and on your coat. Oh my gosh, I'm it's so okay. sorry. It's all but it is really good. And how is your French dip sandwich? It's really good. Yeah. I haven't had one in forever. It, it's just like so cheesy. It looks yummy. It's really good. We just got to the gathering place, which Leah tells me is like a really famous park here yes. in Tulsa. So we are going to get our scooters and I'm very nervous because I am not very coordinated. <laughs> I'm give really nervous. I know I will give it like my best shot. So we're gonna get our scooters and then just ride around as you all can see the park is huge and there's a little cafe in here where you can eat and then out there as we were driving you can see the river so maybe we'll ride along there. Okay, you guys, I have found my scooter, so let's give this a shot. This thing out. Get the kickstand. Oh okay. I believe in you. How do you start it? <laughs> give it a, like, a, a push, like you're skating almost. There you go. Is it going? Yay! You got it! <laughs> but you have gymnast balance. I believed in you this whole time. Okay, this is awesome. Let's do I should, it. Like start doing tricks. Yeah, on this. exactly. <laughs> We came up on a bunch of them right here. So Leah's gonna get this one and then she's gonna whip whip. <laughs> I wanted to take a second to thank my friends over at Skillshare for sponsoring this portion of my vlog. Skillshare is an online learning community that I have recently joined where millions of people come together to take the next step in their creative journey. What I love about this online community is that Skillshare offers thousands of classes that range in different topics from photography, marketing, graphic design, and so much more. I recently took the class Instagram-worthy photography shoot, edit, and share with brand 
Brandon Wolfel. My key takeaway from this class was that you don't always have to have the super high-tech equipment to bring your imagination to life and create beautiful photography to share with the world. I was able to take what I learned and put my new skills to the test when Leah and I went to the Philbrook and took photos of each other. I also wanted to let you all know that the first 1,000 people to click the link in my description box below will receive a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership. And then after that, it is less than $10 a month for a yearly subscription. So make sure that you check out the link and now let's get back to the vlog. Back from the park, we had so much fun. Right now we are on the rooftop of Leah's building and the views out here are stunning. gonna sit out here for a little while and enjoy the sunset. It is so much colder out here now, <laughs> but we are actually about to drive to dinner. We're going to a pizzeria. All right, well, that restaurant is a bust. <laughs> we went in there and they told us it was gonna be an hour and 20 minute wait just for the two of us. So we're getting hungry and that's just a little bit too long. So we're gonna head back to the car where it's warm and figure out somewhere else to eat. It must be a pretty popular place on this Friday night. So we're just gonna figure out on our phones where we're Yo. gonna try to eat. There was a restaurant, another Italian restaurant that was right across the street. It looked so good. It looked so good, it really but did. there weren't any people in there and the website looked super bougie. Mm -hmm. So we think it was probably like really expensive. High dining And uh, we are balling on a budget, so. Big facts. Very big yes. facts. So we're gonna try to find somewhere that is reasonably priced that does not have an hour and 20 minute wait. Yeah. Luckily, we were able to find a new restaurant. It is called Tiamo. Tiamo. Yes, it is called Tiamo. It's another Italian restaurant and we're headed there right now. How do we feel about this restaurant? It does feel very cozy in here. I'm feeling like a margarita pizza or spaghetti tonight, so we'll see. Dinner was fabulous. It was so good. We are both so stuffed and feel really bloated, which is a sign of a great meal. I just got out of the shower. Leah's in the shower right now. We're gonna start winding down and get ready for bed because we are waking up super early tomorrow morning for our flights. I also did want to let you guys know that Leah started her own YouTube channel. She already has her first video up from a trip that she took to Turkey and she's also really big on TikTok, so I will put all of her information in the description box below so you guys can go follow her. It's funny because we were also talking about how when we are recalled, not if, but when we are recalled to start flying again, we are definitely going to buddy bid and try to fly as many trips together as possible. So definitely something to look forward to in the future. But I am getting really tired, so I will see you all tomorrow morning. It is 6.22 a.m. I have not been up this early since before furlough. I was definitely really tired when I woke up and honestly, as soon as I get on this plane, I am probably just going to knock out and go to sleep. Leah is flying to Burbank, California today to visit her family, that's where they live. And so she had to connect through Phoenix. And so we're on different flights. Unfortunately, obviously I am going back to Dallas, like I said. I'm going to board this flight and then probably go to sleep. Just boarded my flight and I think I'm gonna have this whole room to myself. Even though it's only a 30 minute flight, that's still awesome.
I've been home for about an hour now. I've just been laying on the couch and watching <laughs> TV, but I did get a new magnet from Tulsa. You all know that I love collecting magnets, and this is the one that I got from Tulsa. And I'm not sure if I showed you guys this one, but I got this one from Zion National Park. And if you missed those vlogs, make sure that you go and check them out. I think my fridge is starting to look pretty full. Pretty soon, I'm gonna have to start putting magnets on this side. We got Miss Luna hanging out here under the coffee table. She really likes laying on this new rug that we got. Hi, baby. Are you just hanging out? Thank you, everyone, so much from the bottom of my heart for watching and for supporting my channel. I have had a few people ask recently if I have a Patreon, and I do. You can find the link to it in the description box below. And I did add a new feature to it. If you are one of my patrons at any tier level, I've been uploading my vlogs there about a day or two early in advance. So if you would like to contribute to that, it would be greatly appreciated, but obviously not something that would ever be expected. Thank you again, everyone, so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.